I'm Leo Carroll and this is my 2015 Big Stuff application video. So Matt, do you think Leo is a good pastor? Oh yeah, yeah. He's a great pastor. Um, he's, he leads the passion movement, uh, which Wait. I think started back in like 99. No, um, no, no, no. Leo Carroll. Oh, Leo. I thought you said Louie. Uh, Leo, yeah. Leo, um, I think he could be a, a really solid pastor, I think, um, for sure. So Shanks, how do you know uh, Leo Carroll? Well, I went to high school with him and he was one of the first people I got to know in my small group at church. I started coming here freshman year and Leo was already super involved, so he really helped me make my decision to come to Big Stuff the first year. Do you know Leo Carroll? I know, I've seen him around. The uh, older guy on the prayer team. No, the college intern for Oak Bridge. Uh, Leo Carroll? Matt, do you think Leo would be a good servant? Servant leader, maybe? Absolutely. Uh, Leo Carroll is, I think, the definition of a servant leader. And uh, in fact, I had Leo up here uh, earlier this week um, helping me run some errands um, while we were doing some things, need to get some things done. And Leo is extremely trustworthy, reliable kind of guy. Um, hard worker, going to really do anything you need him to do, always there to help you out. Um, and so yeah, Leo is definitely a servant and a great leader as well. Okay, so today on the show, we have an outstanding Oak Bridge intern. A great friend. And a 2015 Big Step applicant. And most importantly, two, two handsome hosts. hosts. This young man we have, that we are describing, is none other than Leo Carroll. Leo has been in attendance at Oak Bridge for all 11 years, and he is a two-time Optern. He is a nine-time attendee to Big Stuff Camps. He is also a spike ball spiker and a cam jam camera. A frisbee fanatic. And a washers warrior. So, so ladies, ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen, we welcome to you Leo Carroll. Kyle, thank you for having me on the show. Sean, thank you. Great to see you again. Good to see you too, Leo. So, Leo. We have heard a lot about you. So first question, we heard you have a personal trainer. Can you tell us about that? Yeah, it's my friend JJ up at uh, Truman State University. He's a wrestler on the team up there. He's approximately four feet, six inches tall, but he can lift more weight than anyone I know. And I'm just, he's got me in the gym and I see a lot of gains with him. I really think that I'm making an improvement and putting on a lot of muscle mass working out with him. We have also heard that the personal trainers had you on a strict diet. Yeah, you know, I was eating really rough at the beginning of the school year. I was eating a lot of uh, grilled chicken, a lot of salad, fruits and vegetables, uh, not drinking any soda. And he just said that was wrong. That's not how you do it. So now I'm drinking six whole pots of coffee a day, uh, about one every two or three hours. And then uh, I'm also eating McDonald's and Taco Bell for every single meal, just going all out. And it's really working great for me. My life is just seeing a great improvement from eating. And just like that, it's wonderful. Leo, we have heard that Big Stuff requires a lot of late nights and early mornings. Can you tell us how you've been preparing for that? Yeah, uh, I've been down to Big Stuff a lot and I know all about this, so I get my friends together almost every night and we start at about 11 o'clock, we'll go till uh, 6 or 7 in the morning, just late at night till early in the morning, just bonding, growing in fellowship. In fact, uh, not too many nights ago we went out and we teepeed Pastor Tom's house and it was just a great time and we all grew and just worshiped through that and it was a wonderful experience. That was interesting preparation. Um, Leo, we've also heard that you lead worship at Oak Ridge. Yeah, they don't have me up there every week, but last week I was up there and I got to sing one of my favorite songs, Jesus I Come by Elevation Worship, and the crowd just really loved it. I loved it. It was just a great thing. I've been called the songbird of my generation by many, so it's just a great deal for me. Thank you, Jesus, just as I am. All right, folks, well, that's all we have for you today. I hope you all enjoyed the show. Catch us next time on Oak Bridge Around the Church. So you should pick me to be a Big Stuff intern in 2015 because I just love Big Stuff. I love what they do, and they mean so much to me personally. This will be my 10th summer going down there if you select me, and I just know that I would not be where I'm at with my faith or anything else without Big Stuff. I was 
brought up in a Christian home and I knew all the right answers and I knew what to say, but I chose not to do that going through my teenage years when I was in high school and without big stuff, I just don't think I'd be on that path. Big stuff really was a place for me to just grow and to just be comfortable in my own skin and with my own faith. And I just wanna be a part to help impact other children and other, other kids so that they can uh, experience that themselves because it's just so important to have your life right with Christ and be headed down that direction. And I just, I love big stuff. I love what they do. And I really think I'd be a great fit for you guys. So pick me.